Hey YouTube, so this is the other guy coming to you tonight. So in tonight's episode, I want to talk to you about stand-up freezers. But before I say that, I want to apologize for the uh, clutterness here. Uh, you see, I have a, I've just opened this right here. My, that's my hunting backpack. I'm stocking it, getting, getting it ready for hunting season. Ice chest, ice chest, getting it ready for ice hunting season too. So anyway, please excuse that mess. Um, it looks like it's kind of cluttered, but it's not. Um, oh, it is. <laughs> That's an empty box right there. I've just unboxed it. So, um, I want to talk to you about a stand-up freezer that I just bought from Costco. And why I feel that I need to let my uh, subscribers know why I decided to buy a Danby. The brand name is Danby. Okay. Danby designer uh, I've never heard of this designer before or this uh, company before but uh, and, and there are folks who are particular uh, uh, they want to be Whirlpool, Kenmore, they want to be um, all those name brand uh, before they buy but this is a Danby brand however the reason why I decided to uh, buy this brand is because I discovered that Costco it doesn't matter if you've lost the receipt or if it's beyond five years, okay? Uh, what I discovered about Costco, okay, is that they warranty the product in such a manner that if you uh, lost the receipt and no matter how long you ha you've had it, if it dies, you can always take it back without the receipt and they will refund you the money that you bought used to buy the the unit here that's what I found out so for example this little folding chair right here and this little uh, chest right here they are both Costco brands so if for any reason they happen to break I can take it back to Costco and they will refund me they will give me a full refund. That's what I discovered. And so that's the reason why I bought a non-brand name brand. Uh, okay, so here, Danby uh, Products Limited, I don't know, Gulf, Ontario, Canada. So it's a Canada company. And I'll be honest with you, I, I work, I service these refrigerators too. So I know I'm a licensed, uh, certified, uh, HVAC uh, tech so I know how to work uh, I know how to fix these stuff the honest truth is okay the electronics and the compressor the condenser the evaporators they're all interchangeable so I can take a whirlpool uh, evaporator coil which is in here and I can make it fit as long as I make it fit it'll work so is the compressor and so is the uh, Condenser, but these units right here the condenser is inside here Okay, so once it goes bad and if you do if the condenser starts to leak That's all she wrote. That's the hiding handwriting in the wall. So but um, But what's good about this is that even if you you don't know anything about ref refrigerators or freezers what's good about this unit is that many 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 moons from now if it breaks because of Costco's impeccable warranty, I can take it back to them and they can they will refund me. So that's why I'm buying this unit, guys. Um, you can agree with me or disagree with me. That's up to you. But that's been my experience with Costco. <clears throat> and for example, I bought a tent, okay, a camping tent. And I've uh, damaged it already. It's already ripped. I'm going to refund that too. That tent has been with me for about five years already. And uh, I'm going to go and get a full refund. I know I sound petty, right? I mean, uh, but that's the warranty that they're willing to uh, guarantee. So if you have a Costco product, uh, take it back to them. They will refund you your money. I just found that out. And we did that. We took a whole bunch of broken folding chairs like that, and uh, they refunded without any questions asked. And I was just like, holy cow. And how I found that out was through my brother-in-laws. 
through my in-laws and uh, they they would buy tent windbreakers uh, uh, stuff like that if they and use it and when they rip or break they return it with no receipts yes because Costco has a particular brand they know their brands so yeah so that's that guys uh, sorry for the long uh, monologue but yeah uh, so this one right here is who do, 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 do. okay so this is the, 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 the dimension um i don't know that's the dimension right here. oh that's the model number right here okay but uh yeah uh 481 kilowatt hour uh saying that it's pretty efficient uh, that's what everybody says nowadays so um but i'll i'll be honest with you uh, the one I the the one that I have currently have that one uh, is way smaller than this one, and this one is way bigger, way bigger. And so that's why I'm buying this one. Uh, I, I actually I didn't I didn't come up with this idea about buying. My wife, she saw it. She's like, Oh, honey, we gotta go buy it. We gotta go buy it. So I was like, Why well, do you have two stand up freezer? You're like, no, this one's way bigger. This one's way better. It's like, okay. All right. If it makes you happy, we'll do it. So, oh, here. So this one, the dimension is 67 uh, and 6 16th of an inch tall. Okay. And the depth is 28 and 8 16th. Uh, uh, yeah, the, the width here. Okay. And the wideness of this, okay, is 29 and 15 16th. So, uh, yeah, overall, overall, it is 16.7 cubic feet uh, uh, in volume inside the bad boy there. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Uh, let me know what your thoughts are. Let's see if you have the same uh, experience with uh, as I have regarding Costco brands. Okay, so that's that, guys. Uh, I know I sound like sort of like uh, frugal on this and penny, penny pinching, but hey, you know what? If I could save a penny, that's a penny uh, saved and a penny earned. That's it.